Hey guys, this is the Revolving Battle Fox here, and in this video, I wanted to make an update on my road to Hatsune Miku Expo 2021. So, if you guys have followed my previous videos, you've known that I've um, made a budget and started a Hatsune Miku savings jar. And I specifically mentioned in my last video that my goal was like a thousand dollars, so pretty much two fifty to get down to Atlanta via via an Uber or a Lyft or whatever, and uh, two hundred and fifty to get back via an Uber or a Lyft or whatever, uh, two fifty for the hotel and two fifty for incidental, so pretty much a thousand more or less. And um, just wanted to let you guys know that I have officially reached my goal. Actually, I've uh, exceeded my goal. So, yay me. Yay me. Um, I'm super happy about it. Um, it took a while to save. Just look at all of that. I've saved by taking 20 bucks out my paycheck every uh, period. So, I have... It was pretty much taking out 40 bucks a month, but in the last month, I figured, let me go ahead and just up it to 100 since I've been working overtime. That way I can reach my goal faster. That and, like, the bank near me is going to be closing, and I just wanted to go ahead and get the, get the money out for this. So that way I can have this uh, goal done, because uh, that bank is close to me. If you also follow my other videos, you know I don't drive, so hence the Uber and the Lyft. But, um, so yeah, I do with the way I get the money out. It's uh, just a lot more convenient having it near my place. But because I'm going to have to travel further and catch a ride or whatever to uh, go to further banks, I figured let me just go ahead and be done with the savings jar and take out a little bit more so I don't have to worry about it. So, yeah, I, I took money out. Uh, my paycheck I sold things I flipped them bought things for a low price sold them on eBay for a marked up price that definitely helped uh, reach the uh, rest of my goal I found change on the ground and I added that if you look closely as you saw earlier it's like change I don't discriminate all the change matters and it helps because change adds up so and I got them wrapped up closely. Well, I've wrapped them up in like little dime bags. And they're like, it's like a dollar each in every coin or in every bag. So, hey, when I go, when it's time for me to count them, it'll be easier that way. And uh, I'll probably add a, a, some more change. Just enough so I can have enough to make exact change. At least one time when I pay for an item. But yeah, it feels good to finally reach this goal so I don't really have to worry about it and to pursue other things. Now keep in mind, um, I have a little over $1,000 saved up for that, but I'm not trying to spend all that. If I spend all that and I'm, I'm, and I'm coming home and the negatives are completely empty, with this uh, jar completely empty, then in my mind something's wrong. I tried to price or I tried to budget out everything on the on the higher end of uh, the scale. That way I have a little bit of money left over. And like I said, I the money's there for Uber or Lyft, but like I said in my last video, I'm considering taking Greyhound at least on the way there. Not really feel, uh feeling taking Greyhound on the way back. Just because the concert's done. My journey's pretty much over at that point and I'm just ready to get home, so I can get ready for work but um yeah that's pretty much it now uh, if I end up not having to take an uber or lyft or whatever or getting a hotel with my cousin if she still uh, happens to take me and all I give her is like 40 50 bucks maybe a gas money then, or if they cancel the show completely because of uh, conflicting schedules or whatever, you're probably asking, what are you going to do with that money? Well, I thought about it and I figured, well, I don't drive, but I need a way to get around, so I'm going to invest in a moped. And 
The more pet shop near me, their range, their price range is like between 900 and 1600 for like a moped. So whatever I uh, don't save or whatever I have left over, if it's a lot, then it'll probably go towards that, which that would be ideal because I, like I said, I'm not trying to spend all that money in um, Atlanta. But, yeah, I wanted to keep this video short. I don't have too much more to say on it. Will I add any more to this jar? The only thing I can see myself adding is maybe a few more quarters. That way I can have exact change or um, be able to produ produce the exact amount of cash at least one time for a transaction. But, yeah, other than that, I might just put what I need uh, back into the to the bank and just kind of use it as I go for uh, times I can't pay cash but it we still have about a year until this comes around I'm predicting this thing or the Hatsune Miku Expo 2020 or 2021 is going to be in May so again that's a little far ways off so for the most part I'm just not going to be thinking just about my savings jar like I said, going to move on to something else. Going to probably start uh, saving more money to invest in myself, invest in businesses like I want to do, like print on demand or whatever. And I'll talk about that in another video. But for now, let's just celebrate my um, meeting my goal. Yay. And I, I pray. I, I pray to God I don't have to dip out of that for whatever reason beforehand. But... If I have to, I'm just glad it's the extra money that's there and I can always build it back up, hopefully. So, um, I'm happy about it. If you still want to support me, you know, you can check out my eBay store. Because, you know, the more of the merrier when it comes to money. But, uh, yeah, with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this video up. It's a little bit longer than what I wanted it to be. So, if you're... If uh, you like this video, or you're a fan of video games, or drink tests, taste tests, toys, reviews, stuff like that, then feel free to check out the rest of my channel. And if you happen to like what you see, then please leave a like, comment, share, subscribe, do what you gotta do, and I will see you all in my next video. Alright guys, talk to you later. Bye!